What's up, sports bettors? I've already given out a lot of player props, a lot of parlay picks for tonight, including this 1,000 to win 20K entry, five pick parlay. All we have to do is win five player props to 20X our money. Um, but I have another one right here with Trey Young that I'm gonna share with you. And again, on Underdog Fantasy, we've been having videos about it because there's been a lot of good betting opportunities. It's really that simple, right? And the way this platform works is pretty fascinating. Any three picks you select, you're betting one to win six. Betting one to win five in profit. Any three leg parlay, you're betting one to win five in profit, which is plus 500 odds. So this platform essentially just says, hey, every three leg parlay you create is at plus 500 odds. You bet 10 to win 60, 50 in profit, plus your $10 stake back. So we've gone through the math before, but essentially what this means is underdog fantasy is charging the implied juice of minus 122 on the overs and the unders. So any pick you select in a three or a five pick entry, you are betting at minus 122 juice. Now in a two pick entry, it's minus 137. So it's a lot worse, right? The juice is a lot higher, which is why you'll notice nearly all of the entries I'm placing on underdog fantasy are gonna be three pick or five picks, right? We're not really placing two pick entries because it doesn't make sense because you're getting such worse odds. So anyways, what we need to do as a sharp better is find three or five sharp bets with an edge on underdog fantasy. So what we can do is we can use odds jam right? Odds Jam has millions of odds updating in real time every second. I mean, this is literally one game, the Magic Rockets game. I don't even know how many NBA games there are tonight, but a lot. This is one game, right? And then this is one market. <laughs> so sportsbooks offer you a lot of stuff you can bet on. And it's not like you can manually scan through all these lines and be like, hey, where's their value? But what Odds Jam will do for you is it will just point out Hey, on underdog, here's a play on Trey Young that has some value. Under eight and a half assists at minus 122. So there were actually some other plays that looked pretty good. Royce O'Neal over four and a half rebounds. Chris Olave under five and a half receptions. D'Angelo Russell under five and a half assists. All these plays look good, but I've hit my max betting limit on each of those players. So again, they limit you to a certain amount you're allowed to bet per player. And it kind of seems to change from day to day because I was able to get down, you know, it looks like $3,000 total on Curry and on D'Angelo Russell. But for my NFL pick, Chris Olave, they only let me bet a max of $1,000. So I'm going to skip over these top three profit margin plays. But if you haven't bet them, I highly recommend this is your three pick entry if you want three picks. So let's go back. I'm on Trey Young under eight and a half assists. So as a sharp better, you're always looking for value. You're looking for edges. You know, the point of this YouTube channel isn't to tell you you can get rich quick sports betting. It's not true, right? I worked as a quant on Wall Street. I spent so much free time, probably all my free time betting on sports, <laughs> is um, it's not something where you're gonna make a million bucks overnight. Or if so, you might as well go to 7-Eleven and play the scratch off lottery, right? Odds Jam, is all about finding data-driven picks with an edge. So this play on Trey Young tonight has a 1.36% profit margin. So you parlay it with a couple other bets that have slightly higher profit margin bets, you're gonna get an underdog fantasy entry with like a 5, 10% profit margin, right? Super profitable, which is why underdog fantasy uh, is a platform you can make a lot of money off of as a sharp better. So what we'll notice here for our first pick is Trey Young under eight and a half assists the under is heavily juiced on all the sports books. We're getting it minus 122 implied odds. All the sports books are pricing it, you know, minus 139 on Pinnacle to minus 180. Vandal has this minus 180. We're getting this minus 122 on underdog. So that's the first play I went with. Then I went with Derek White under two and a half assists. So I actually already have this play on Betway Sportsbook. Um, I bet this minus 115, but now the values on underdog fantasy, so I doubled down. Here you can see the profit margin is higher, 
right? So the profit margin of this play is higher. And then the final pick I went with is right here. Jalen Green, over two and a half made threes. All the sports books have the over heavily juiced. We're finding value, values, all that matters as a sharp better long term. And then you just refresh odds jam and you see what other opportunities exist on underdog fantasy. Maybe there are none, maybe there are some. You know, it looks like, hey, looks like dang, you know, now the value is in Jalen Brown. You're able to find some things to pair this with. Getting him under six and a half rebounds at minus 122 looks pretty incredible. So find three or five sharp picks. They're all at minus 122. So odd sham, you know, there's no BS. It just shows you, hey, for Jalen Brown, you know, this is where there's value. That's all odd sham does, right? It shows you plays with value. There's no BS, nothing about sports, all math, numbers, and data. So hopefully this video was helpful. Let's make money.